Hi Yellow Room friends! I have two new sheep books to, to read to you. These sheep, they get just so silly and get into such trouble. Let's see what they're going to do here. This says, Sheep on a Ship. Sheep on a ship, Nancy Shaw is our, what, author, right, and illustrated by Margot Apple. Sheep sail a ship on a deep sea trip. Waves lap, sails flap. Sheep read a map, but begin to nap. Uh -oh. What do you think would happen if everybody on the ship was napping? Dark clouds form. A sudden storm. Look, the Z's means they're sleeping. I think they're sleeping. It rains and hails and shakes the sails. Sheep wake up and grab the rails. What are the rails? Yeah, the rails. Waves wash across the ship. Waves slosh. Sheep slip. Oh my goodness, look at all that water. Decks tip. Sheep slide. Sheep trip. Sheep collide. You hearing the rhyming words? Winds whip, sails rip. Sheep can't sail, they're sagging ship. Look at the fish down here coming out of the portholes. And <laughs> a shark hanging on. <laughs> they chop a mast to make a raft. Their mast is right here. That's what held their sails. And so now they're going to make a raft out of their mast. Sheep jump off their sailing craft. The storm lifts. The raft drifts. Land ho, not far to go. Sheep come paddling into port. Sheep jump off. Sheep fall short. <laughs> They're so anxious to get off. They fell into the water. Sheep climb out. Sheep drip. Sheep are glad to end their trip. Oh, they get into such fixes, these, ship, these sheep on the ship. We have another sheep story called Sheep Take a Hike. All right. Here, we have a backpack. Putting some food in the backpack. Sheep take a hike. I like their hats. There's a hat with a feather. Oh, here's a good, good picture of them all hiking. <laughs> Do you spot a moose?
Morning's here. It's warm and clear. It's not so warm here today, but it is clear. Sheep load up their hiking gear. Compass whistles, drinks, and snacks go in packs upon their backs. Can you see all that? They trot along a hiking trail. Here's the, here's the bird that, it's kind of like um, elephant and piggy. You know how there's always the, the, the little pigeon? This, these books always seem to have a little seagull. Up the hill and down the dale. Trees and bushes soon grow thicker. Where's the trail? Sheep, bicker. What does bicker mean? Well, they talk to each other, they kind of argue. They're arguing about who's right and which way they should go. And they're looking at their compass right here. Sheep squeeze through the trees. Sheep rush through the underbrush. Thorns dig, prickers snag, sheep zig, sheep zag. Fog comes up, the ground feels damp. On and on, sheep tramp. Who sees them? Can you see over here? Who sees them? Sheep stomp into a swamp. <gasps> Mush, gush, boggy tracks. Yuck, muck, soggy backs. Blub, blub, soppy packs. Glub, glub, gloppy snacks. Oh my. Do you see anything in here that reminds you of another book that Celissa read? Right here and right here. What do you think that is? <gasps> the compass sinks, they're in dismay. How can they ever find their way? Ah! And there's the moose. Sheep climb out of the slime. Oh, look at this poor little one. The moose is helping. They look around and soon they find woolly fuzz left behind. What do you think all this woolly fuzz, where the woolly fuzz came from? Hmm. I think maybe from the sheep because they're woolly and fuzz, fuzzy. Sheep won't stray. They've marked the way. Now they're on their hiking path. They found their way out by finding their own woolly fuzz. What more could they want? A bath. Sheep trot homeward. Rain pours. What a day for the great outdoors. I hope that you're getting outdoors while we are off from school. Especially today, the sun is out. Just make sure you put your coat and your hat and mittens on and go out and have some fun. Maybe you can go down to a local playground or maybe just play in your own backyard. I hope you're having fun and we miss you and have a very good day. We'll be reading more stories. I don't have any more sheep stories, but I'll find some other stories to read. Bye!